That the country has been grappling with rampant corruption, especially in public service, is no longer a secret. State agencies have also doubled their efforts to catch up with culprits, and it is now emerging that the country is in the process of setting up a fund specifically aimed at collecting all monies recovered from graft suspects. This was disclosed by Director of Public Prosecution, Nurdin Haji, after a meeting with human rights campaigners who scaled Mount Kenya to raise awareness on rights violations. We're setting up what we're calling a prosecution fund, not the, not the judiciary. This is a prosecution fund. And it's going, to, it's going to be a fund that will collect all monies that have been covered from corruption. According to Haji, the proceeds from corruption will then be redirected to the National Treasury for use by the state to finance various development projects. A tough-talking Haji insists that the move has been prompted by the need to have all the monies recovered from corruption accounted for for the benefit of Kenyans. This is set up um, and ready. We've had a little bit of, 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 of a problem with, with the Treasury. My argument is that we, we take this money back to Treasury, we don't see where it's going. Right. So it must go somewhere where we will have people of integrity who will be able to show Kenyans how this money has been restituted back to where they were taken. The DPP said corruption is hindering the country from fulfilling its development aspirations. Um, in our endeavor to fight corruption, as a priority right now in ODPP and, 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 and the country in general. Uh, I think we, we, are, we, are, we are trying to ensure that human rights are secured and protected. Kamche Menza for Channel One News.